Hi everyone, we're finally going to do book mash today. I've been wanting to do this video forever and I figured that since it is today's challenge for Bout of Books, this is about as good of a time to do book mash as any. If you don't know how to play mash, I will, um, I'll leave the rules down below. So go check it out. The basic idea is to list a number of options per category and then one by one you cross them off and see what's left in each category and then that is your life. So this is the bookish edition and all the all of the categories and the options are going to have to do with different books. So let's just get started. Uh, for my best friend, let's put Leslie. Leslie from Ruby Red. She's an awesome best friend. Um, let's, let's also go with Luna Lovegood. She's pretty awesome. Okay, I'm gonna put Estrel from Green Rider. She's probably one of my best, uh, one of my favorite best friend characters in like any book. For the bad one, let's put Saskia from Tell Me Again How a Crush Should Feel. She's a terrible human being, a terrible friend. Um, I need one more. Uh, let's put Helene from An Ember in the Ashes. Uh, then for my spouse, for the bad one, we have to put Joffrey, okay. Then Margot from Paper Towns. Kale from Throne of Glass. I've got to put someone from Throne of Glass, so I'll just put Kale. Leaf from The Sin Eater's Daughter. And, oh, I need one more. Okay, I need one more. Um, I'll just put Nasreen from If You Could Be Mine. And for my pet, well, I have to put a dragon. I have to put a cork beast from The Last Dragon Slayer. A dire wolf. An owl. And for the bad one, let's put one of the weird hunting dogs from The Sin Eater's Daughter. If you haven't read that book, like, those dogs are, like, messed up and creepy and their fur is, like, all sticky and bristly and they, like, eat horses and people and whatever else. Alright, transportation. I'm gonna put a firebolt. And uh, for the bad one, let's put walking. Um, a hoverboard from the Ugly series. I think that's what they ride. A green rider horse. I don't know whether to put flying or a pirate ship, but I guess if um, if I already have a fire bolt, I'll just put a fire a pirate ship. For my occupation, I'm gonna put an auror. Something from Harry Potter in almost every category. It's funny. Pirate. I already have a pirate ship. I might as well put pirate. Dragon slayer. I'll put a potioner from Poison. I need a bad one. Um. Okay, I'll just I'll just put Defense Against the Dark Arts Teacher for the bad one because I'd only last th there like one year because no one no one lasts. Okay, now what world do I live in? Uh, let's put District Twelve from The Hunger Games because that would suck. That can be the bad one. Wizarding World. Let's just put Uglyville. We can put Westeros, although I guess that is kind of a bad one too. It kind of depends on who you are though. Then let's just go with the Ununited Kingdoms from uh, The Last Dragon Slayer. I'm gonna figure out my magic number. My magic number is five. Ha, huh, I don't have to have a creepy dog from The Sin Eater's Daughter. I'm not riding a pirate ship, I guess. I'm not the Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher, so I will have job security. Oh, I don't get a dire wolf. I don't get a green rider horse either. Ha, I don't live in District 12. Askia is not my best friend. Oh, I don't get a cork beast. That's sad. Dang, I'm not an auror. Well, I don't live in Uglyville. I guess that's good. Estrel is my best friend. I don't get an owl. I'm not a dragon slayer. I'm living in a shack. What the hell? I'm riding a firebolt. <sighs> I am not married to Joffrey. Thank you. I am living in Westeros. Good luck. <laughs> now it's just between two occupations. All right, I'm a potioner. Okay, so here's what I have. I'm living in a shack in Westeros. <laughs> I'm a potioner. I ride a firebolt. <laughs> My best friend is Estrel from Green Rider, and I'm married to Leaf from The Sin Eater's Daughter, and my pet is a dragon. There's my dragon right now. <laughs> the dog always like sneaks into my videos. It's always completely by accident. 
Like when I was living with iPod, the cat, I had to bring her into the room and make her be in the videos and she didn't want to. But now I have a dog who like wants to be in the videos. It's weird. As I said, I'm gonna leave the rules to MASH down below. Um, so go check it out. If you decide to try this too, let me know what you get because I'm curious. I'll have another video up in a couple days and so I will see you then. Bye!